Now, Channel 3, early warning weather. Not much rain is in the forecast, which is an issue for parts of south southeast New England and for a big chunk of Connecticut that's looking for the rain. We're going to see some low amounts between Thursday and early Friday, but otherwise we are definitely looking forward to some nicer weather. There's no way around it. We are happy about this forecast for the weekend. And as of right now, skies are starting to clear. Temperatures are going to boost into the upper 80s. As a result, we are not looking at very much rain, let alone cloud cover to the west at this moment. So if you live in central and eastern Connecticut, there should be some emerging sun here in the next few hours. Drought monitor showing us a severe drought for eastern Connecticut, all of Rhode Island, all of southeast Massachusetts. And we need quite a bit of rain to put that into reversal. And at this point, it might need to be some tropical activity, lots of thunderstorms, anything like that. But we're not seeing any signs because we keep getting these relatively dry cold fronts pushing through, which is just not going to be able to give us too much. Between now and tomorrow morning, very little rain is expected. There will be an opportunity for some rain showers early on Thursday. So that's the first one. The second opportunity for rain is going to come after work, after school, so most of Thursday is going to appear dry, but there could be some showers real early and at night. In fact, some of those showers may continue into the early morning hours of Friday. So uh, overall, what I looked at today, it looks like Southeast Connecticut has the best chance of getting up to a tenth of an inch and for a few towns, maybe a quarter of an inch. But to be clear, many places will completely strike out with the rain for tomorrow and then no chance of rain Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Right now we are in the 80s and 70s across the hills right now along the shoreline. We have about 80 degrees and it's not like it's just not raining anywhere. It's just we're not in the right place at the right time. There is some offshore activity and Massachusetts is going to capture some rain in parts of Maine but not so much here in the western part of New England. So Monday morning, there is a chance for some rain showers, including Connecticut. It's just more likely that oh, it's all going to start uh, be pushed offshore as being opposed to in Connecticut. Six to ten days out from now, we have some better chances of precipitation. And as far as the temperatures go, it's looking and trending a little on the below average side which we love to see any time in the summer. We always want to see those blue shades over us, and that's the perfect combo, right? We want rain, and we want to stay cool. And that looks like that's something we could see seven days from now. We got the cool part that's happening for the weekend, but we got to hang tight for some decent precipitation. Old Saybrook right now, sticking with cloudy skies. Same thing along New Haven. We're, we got plenty of clouds for the shoreline, but some sun for western Connecticut. High temperatures for today. We're in the mid 80s and we've got some nice temperatures ahead for the weekend. Look at that Saturday morning, 57 degrees. Some of the hills will be in the mid 50s compared to what we've had recently. That will feel like there's a little chill in the air. Even Sunday too. If you're waking up at sunrise, 58 degrees, blue skies is going to feel phenomenal outside. Low humidity Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Monday looking great as well. So if you want to maybe extend the weekend Friday or Monday, this is definitely want the one to do that. And then we start seeing some rain chances return to the state this upcoming Tuesday. And I think we're all just really happy about not seeing any 90s on there. Roger.